Limiting beliefs. They're those kind of things that constrain us, keep us in some kind of way. And just by believing them, we don't think, we don't do or say the things that they inhibit. Kind of holds us in a bit of a bondage, a prison. And by doing that, we can impoverish, impoverish our lives as well as the lives of other people. <laughs> we've, got, we've got many beliefs, let's face it. We have beliefs about rights, about duties, about abilities. We have uh, beliefs about permissions, and you know, I can go on and on with the types of beliefs that we have, but limiting beliefs, but they're often about ourselves, and they're about our, our self-identity. And right now, during this time with the coronavirus, COVID-19 going on, there's a lot of things going on that are, that are battling for your beliefs and your thoughts. The beliefs may also be about what other people in the world in general are thinking. Right, so I want to share with you today seven limiting beliefs, and I'm, I'm offering that today in a free guide I want to give you. I'll tell you about that here in just a moment. So here are those seven limiting beliefs that you definitely want to get rid of in your life. Number one, do you believe what others say about you? Number two, determine the source of your belief. Number three, your declaration. What is that? Number four, imagine being free from that belief. Number five, replace the belief. Six, find evidence for a new belief. Number seven, test yourself. So vitally, vitally important. Let's just be real, we're, we're gonna experience a lot of difficult times ahead of us here in the world, in our world community now. The world marketplace, it's bleeding. And fear is now gripping hearts on people's lives around the world. Doubt is a creeper that's subtly seducting people and slowly infecting people and moving into their lives, which means for you listening today, this is a perfect time to kill some limiting beliefs and press into the life you've always wanted to live. There's going to be a lot of that happening in people's lives over the next six to 12 months as a result of this bad thing that could provide a good thing. Now, there are those that will choose to retreat during a pandemic like this. And then there's going to be those who will make a choice, a choice to press in, a choice to dig in, a choice to say, I'm ready for something different. I want to encourage you to press in, not just so you can pay your bills, not just to become rich one day, have money and things and toys, <laughs> not, not, not that, but not even just to live your dream life, but to be joyfully content with your life and the way in which you're able to live it and how you can help others to do the same. I mean, that's the definition of success. I told you a moment ago about these seven seven things, limiting beliefs you want to banish from your life. And I want to give you a short little guide to help kill some mindset issues, mindset issues, easy for me to say, and plant and plant some healthy ones in your life. All right. So I'm giving you a little bit of a challenge, a little homework that you can go through this short little guide and uh, hopefully be able to have some focus and uh, difference in what you're wanting to accomplish in your own personal life uh, as a result of some of the things that are happening right now. I mean, after hearing so many different stories over and over and over again about thought processes in people's lives since COVID-19 has entered all of our lives, you know, I've, seen something, I've seen something that's being neglected and something that I'm really, really passionate about. Hope. Now, we have a lot of it. Way more hope is available than COVID-19. <laughs> So I wrote a new song yesterday. Uh, I've been thinking about some things. The words came to me and I put it together in a song I wrote for you called Sunshine Again. I'm gonna give that song to you today as I release this and I, I hope you'll listen to the words. I hope that, that the song itself will speak hope into your life as well. So maybe the little seven steps I'm giving to you the song is motivation might be something to really empower you. And I, I asked you to help me to spread this song. I want it to go viral. I want it to go around the world. It's free, so I'm not going to make any money. 
<laughs> I want you to share it with your friends. All right, I'm also asking you that if you like the guide, uh, use it, first of all, give it away. Give it to other people to use as well. Yeah, it's got my branding on it and stuff, but I think it's important for people to get. I want it in their hands. I want people to have a fresh start. I want you to have a fresh start. I want you to be able to experience incredible opportunities ahead because that's what's available. All right, so I hope, I really hope that you'll enjoy this little challenge, little free guide that I've given to you. And we're going to get through this. No problem. There's hope. There's great things that are in front of us, my friends. There will be sunshine again. Flip out. Sunshine. Warms the earth and the body, the soul. Just see it again.